In Red Studio XC3, we now support gestures in your FireMonkey Windows and Macintosh applications. So let me show you how easy it is to add gestures to your applications. We'll say File New FireMonkey Application for Delphi. We'll create an HD FireMonkey application, and we'll put a panel down, and we'll use that panel to make our gestures. And then we'll put a label, and in the label we'll display what gestures are found as we're using them. We'll also add a gesture manager, and now when we select the panel, we can go down in the object inspector and connect using the touch property. We can connect the gesture manager to the panel. And underneath that, we have all the standard gestures, so we can just check uh, whatever gestures we want to use. And then on the events tab, there's an on gesture event for the panel. So as we make gestures in the panel, uh, we'll get information about the gesture, and we can use it in our application. Inside the on gesture event, we'll declare a variable which is of type string. We we'll use a new built-in function called gesture to ident, which is part of the FireMonkey support for gestures. It takes the gesture ID from the event info and returns it as a string, and then we can put in the label what gesture we made uh, as the name of the gesture. So let's run this application. And now we make gestures inside for the gestures that are enabled, circle, chevron, chevron right, up, down, and so on. So that's how easy it is to add gestures to a Delphi application. Let's do the same thing in a FireMonkey C++ application. So we'll say FireMonkey Desktop C++ HD FireMonkey application. We'll put a panel down, and we'll put a gesture manager. And then inside the panel, we'll connect up the gesture manager. And then we'll just choose a few gestures that we want. And then we'll put a label down, and that's where we'll display what gesture that we made in the panel. And in the panel, the on gesture event for C++, put some code. This code will call gesture to ident, pass the event info gesture ID, we'll get the string, and then we'll just store into the label the name of the gesture that we made. And now when we make our gestures, left, right, up, down, if we make a gesture that's not enabled uh, in the gesture manager, the event handler will get SGI, no gesture. But if it's one that we've selected to handle, then we get the right identifier. Now let's run this FireMonkey gesture application on Macintosh just to show that it also works for Windows and Mac. Here we have the application, and on the Macintosh we need to use a touchpad or trackpad on Macintosh and use two fingers. If you use one finger, it just moves the cursor around. If you make a gesture with two fingers, like left, right, up, down, then we get the gestures firing through the event. So gestures in FireMonkey for Delphi and C++ work on Windows and Macintosh in your applications.